I've been here meeting uh, the staff uh, and the students at Kingston University to hear about this, future skills, and how Kingston University has done some really amazing research and is now applying those lessons for the student experience here at Kingston University, where there are ideas of navigate, to help people navigate through HE, then explore so they're working in a multidisciplinary way, and then apply so they can take those life skills uh, through into the world of work and the world beyond the university. As a music technology student, it's very important knowing your worth because majority of us when we leave university may become freelancers, we may work with a company. Either way, it's all about networking and knowing how to talk to people in the right sort of way. Some of the skills I we could say to talk about is creative problem solving or collaboration or resilience. For example, if I'm in a studio and something goes wrong, I need to be able to go, mm, well, this has gone wrong, how can I overcome it? One of the best parts about the Navigate session is being able to take students out of the context of their own subject and being able to talk about the wider career world and also about themselves. Having it be part of the curriculum that we're studying makes it a lot more valuable for us because it gives everyone the same, the same set of skills to leave university with at the end. I was really pleased today to host a delegation of three of our local MPs. Ed Davey, leader of the Liberal Democrats, the education spokesperson, Manira Wilson, and the business spokesperson, Sarah Olney. Our future skills reports have clearly shown what businesses say they need to meet the challenges of the future. And this uh, session included uh, students talking about their own experience and a description about how we work with industry and how we are delivering the future skills agenda for our students and for businesses.